Hey guys, in today's video, I'm gonna be walking you through three different things that you can try to fix whatever problem you might be having with your Android TV. In today's video, I'm using my Mi Cool KM8 Android TV box, and I do run into some issues every now and again, and I work my way through these three steps, and it often fixes a lot of the problems that arise. So the first thing that we're gonna do is simply restart our device. To do this, you can unplug the power source from your Android TV box, wait about 30 seconds, plug it back in. For me, I also have the option where I can just hold down the power button on my remote and then toggle to the restart position. But you also might just be in a situation where your device is completely frozen, where unplugging the power source, waiting 30 seconds, plugging it back in is probably going to be your best bet to go through this reboot phase. Now, after you restart, check to see if things are working. If it's not, the next thing I recommend is checking on your internet connection. So we're gonna go ahead and click settings and then go to network. And then make sure your Wi-Fi is toggled to the on position and then find your wireless router. Make sure it says connected and that you have a strong signal. But I'll also say that a lot of these Wi-Fi adapters on the Android TV boxes aren't necessarily the greatest. So if you do have the option to directly connect in through an Ethernet cord, I highly recommend going with that option. I have this option on my device. I'm actually not currently connected through Ethernet, but I notice a huge difference when I am connected through Ethernet compared to just going through the wireless router. Now, you might still be connected to your wireless router, but not getting internet. That might be an issue where you have to reset your wireless router. So go over to your internet box in your house, the wireless router, unplug it, wait about 30 seconds, plug it back in and have it reset. It still might be an internet issue after that where it's just the internet's down in your area and you should contact your internet provider if that's the case. Now, if it's not an internet issue, the next thing I recommend trying is actually just uninstalling an application that might not be working and then reinstalling it. I have had this issue with different applications and I've uninstalled them, reinstalled them, and then whatever issue I was running into, I was able to fix. So go to the Google Play Store, find whatever application isn't working right for you, search for it, and then go ahead and click uninstall and then click reinstall and then it's going to obviously go through the installation process and depending on how large the application is might be quick might take a little bit of time once it's done installing you can actually open up the application right here from the installation page to check to see if that fixed the problem also you can just go back to the home page click the little plus icon find the application, select it to put it back on your main line here of different apps. And of course you can move it to whatever position that you need it in. And then you can select on it again to see if it's working. So guys, those are the three different steps and things to try to fix your Android TV device, a reboot restart, as well as checking on your internet connection and uninstalling and reinstalling applications. So that's going to wrap this video up. Thanks for stopping on in. Subscribe for more. Hope to see you guys back here for future videos.